Alex, congratulations on a brilliant show. Can you just give us your reaction to, to being here today and what, and what have you made of the place? Do you know what I love when we take football focus on the road because you can just tell how passionate the fans are, what the football club means to fans, and you just get that real energy and buzz. And I love hearing the stories, to meeting people like George, the kit man who's been involved for seven years. So obviously the guys playing the drums and the trumpet, Nathan and Frankie. Like I, I just love it. And as you can see, I'm really smiling because this is what it's all about. And this is why we need to be celebrating and spending more time with non-league football to promote such atmospheres and what it does for and the facilities here as well, what, what do you make of the ground? And, and, and what The facilities here as well, oh. and the ground, what, what do you make of it? The ground, the facilities, you can see you've got all the infrastructure ready to be moving up the pyramid. Um, but obviously you need to start from somewhere and build that base and that's why it's great for stories like that, to, for everyone to know and understand what it means. I'm going to say non-league day, it's really important, isn't it, that you, you see how, what, it, what it means to a community, how much football really does mean. Is, does it bring it home to you when, when you come on sort of trips like this? Yeah, and for fans to be coming out so early, the kickoff's not till 3 o'clock and everyone's coming in the gates at half 11 because they want to be a part of it. Um, and that's why I'm so happy that a show like Football Focus can celebrate things like that and for people to understand why we do it as well. And obviously you couldn't pick a nice idea to come out as really? well. It's not really an, a typical northeast day, but come from the northeast as well. What do you make of the northeast people and, and how much you enjoy coming to this? Yeah, the world. You know, I've always I've had family up here. I still have family up here, so I've always known the spirit and how passionate everyone is, and how friendly um, and how welcoming everyone's made me feel today. So thank you to everyone at South Shields because I've really enjoyed my day. And just finally, obviously, you hear South Shields for the first time today. It's will what? You, you hear South Shields for the, for the first time today. Mm -hmm. What will you be taking away from your experience here, and will you be in a, sort of an honorary mariner from here on in? <laughs> yes, I think I am. I think the fans have taken me as one of their own. You know, I love my shandy. Feeling part of it, everyone's on the wine, the curry and the chips, um, but ultimately we know it's about the football and we know you, you're second in the league, you've got six games to go, but ultimately the aim of it is to get promotion. So hopefully today, do the business, um, Kevin doesn't want any goals conceded, even though we had a prediction of 3-2, but a win's a win. <laughs>